Hello everyone, it's me Thap again, and we're back here in Turtle Wow on the Enhanced Shaman. And we're here in Terran Mill. Uh, I'm gonna start turning in the quest. Uh, I think it's here. Yep. Turn that quest in. Wrong thing. Elixir of pain. So I'm gonna do the quest around here. I did uh go and turn in the quest in Undercity for Shadowfin Keep. And while I was there, I did go ahead and purchase some Mage Weave bags off the AH. So that way we have more inventory room. So I can farm up stuff now if I want and have some space. Oh, we're going to grab. Oh, that is a quest. All right, cool. Couldn't remember if that was a quest or not. And then I think there's one upstairs. Oh, no, wait, there's another poster right here, huh? Grab that as well. Alright, so now we have stuff all over our screen. And it's levels 22, 24, and 28. So what's the 28 one? That way I... Uh, clerk, miner, farmer. That's here, right? Yeah. So we'll get to that eventually. But for now, let's uh just take out some of these easy guys that are just around here. So I need bears and the uh, spiders. Oops. Well, that helps. I wasn't thinking that they would uh help me. But apparently, I was in range of the guards, so. We will slowly work on knocking all these out. And for now, I just need spiders and uh, the bears. Then we'll work on some of the other stuff. But I did manage to get my uh, new boots from that quest. And that ring. Just got some more boots. That might actually be... Hot to look. So, I lose strength, but I gain... I lose a lot of stamina, though. And AC. So, not ideal. But I do need to make up some more money now. I am getting close to 24, which will be new spells and stuff, but... I don't even really have the money to go purchase them. I think that's how I bought the bags. So first things first, I need to uh, get some of my money back. Or farm up some money, I should say. Need to heal. We can throw down totems. But usually these things don't last long enough to have to worry about it, but... Uh, copper. But in six more levels, that's when we get to have, uh, some more.
more fun. Because that's when, uh, we will actually get Twin Fury. And that's the reason I like shamans a lot. But then, you guys will be able to see, uh, exactly why once I get a few more levels. We're like out. Ooh, I should actually buy some food and uh, water now that I think about it. I mean, we could just sit and get back some of it, but yeah, I may want to go get some food and water. I may go purchase some after we take this guy out. All right, let's go run back to town real quick and I'll buy some food and drink. That way we won't have so much downtime. Because I don't have a ton of uh, spirit to get back my mana fast. And I sold all my food and drink that I had. It's just like low level stuff, so I could use some fresh, like level appropriate materials. All right, let's sell all the gray items. I'll go ahead and sell these as well. I uh, will sell that big bear meat. Sure. All right, so general goods, refreshing spring water, melon juice. It's actually pretty expensive. 436, like how much mana do we actually have? I don't think it tells me. You know what, we'll just get uh, milk for now. Oop, we bought a lot of milk. That's all right. Put that down on our bar. And now we, when we run out of mana, we can just uh, get some back. I need to redo my weapon. Luckily, this stuff isn't like super hard to kill, especially when I get help. All right, so there's the one piece I needed from the spider. Now I just need five more of these uh bears. I need lion blood as well. And now that I think of it, I think there's, yeah, there's a quest guide on here, too. That I'm gonna have to look into. And I may end up just, like, grinding out some levels just by killing stuff, just to make some extra money. Not even worry about, uh... Getting, like, quests and stuff. Like, do the quest over here, but then just kill the humans over here for, uh, like, cloth and wool and stuff. Because humanoids usually have the best chance of dropping, like, greens as far as I'm aware. Like, actual items you can wear and stuff. Like bears and animals, they usually just drop uh, the random gray loot you can sell. And also, uh, you can skin them and stuff, so. But I don't have skinning, so. Ideally, I'll want to mess around with the humanoids more.
Alright. Take him out. Uh, we'll sit and drink real quick. And I shouldn't have, like, a ton of, uh, mana because I'm going enhanced, not elemental. So the lesser drink is okay. I mean, it takes longer for it to fill up, but... I could buy, like, the melon juice that costs, like, four times as much. And just drink it for a couple ticks, but... It seems kind of wasteful on the money front. But I may end up trying to run, uh, the more of the Shadow Pin Keep. I did just get a level, though. To get some more items and also experience. Because running dungeons is okay experience still. Alright, there's my Grey Bears done. I think there might also be something in this tower. I don't know what exactly, though. Been forever. But I do remember something being here. For some reason. You're going down. All right, so we got some blood. Oh yeah, I still have a talent point I can spend. I'm gonna put some more in ancestral guardian, and then my next one's probably gonna go into flurry. Oh, uh, seems like there's a mage. Why is he got three or four? What are you doing? I'll kill him if you don't want him. I don't know what you're doing. Dude. You need health? Yes, you do. Here. About. All right. We should be good on. I guess in, he was trying to AOE stuff down and then just got too many that he couldn't handle. Which happens sometimes when you're playing a mage. All right, well, let's take that one out. Get some more blood. We'll get some more mana back. But ideally, I'd like to get over 30 and then get like a king, uh, the decapitator, like axe. With wind fury and just go crazy on stuff. Because that's how, basically what I was doing on my shaman back in the day. Is Kang has like a direct damage proc. So even if you didn't get like Wind Fury, you had a chance of like uh, hitting him with a direct damage spell. And plus it doesn't hurt that it looks awesome. All right, uh, we got tons of bears. Don't really want bears. That guy's AOEing down like four mountain lines over there. We need our lightning bolt back up.
Oh, uh, we could take out the barriers if we have to, but ideally, since I've already got the barriers I need, I'm going to try to bypass them as much as I can. And I guess I must have flagged myself for PvP when I healed that guy. So hopefully that will go away before uh, some alliance kills us. Also, the great thing about being a shaman, you got the lesser healing wave, so you can just heal yourself up after you get done killing something. Which I'm always a fan of. The yetis are 31, yeah. Like, I remember the yetis, and I remember them being at a really higher level than the normal stuff around here. Because I remember doing quests here, leaving, and then coming back to do more quests. Nothing. Alright, oh. Uh... Oh, don't want it. The Yeti. And then these are like the little farmer guys, little peon farmhand dudes. All right, uh, I mean, we can kill a mountain lion, or a bear. I don't want to have to be running around all this stuff all day long. I used to dodge them just because I didn't have the inventory space to pick up all the stuff that they dropped. Is the main reason. Oh, I don't like the fact that he tried to get behind me though. Right, we got some more blood. We'll get back some more mana real quick. And what do we got to do over here? The rogues. All right, I remember this. As well. Which that can be a pain because if you get down in there and stuff. You'll have to kill a whole bunch of stuff. And plus the bosses and stuff that you got to kill are, are somewhat of a pain. All right, so we got farm hands. And I remember all these quests. I think I remember them for the most part. I think there's a guy, I don't know if he's in the barn. I know there's one in a building uh, up here. It does look like there's maybe one in the barn. We got farmers, farm hands, farmer Ray and farmer gets. Well, I believe that's one of them. Oh, that's a citizen. I don't know if I need to kill a citizen guy. Oh, citizen, citizen. Yeah, I do. This is for the harder quest, though. And that's because some of these guys are like in the main building over here and stuff and they're kind of a pain to get to. Armor gets.
Go down. Uh, we need to heal. I'll use some more healing as well, but stop running. Thank you. Oh yeah, watermelon. All right, so where's this other guy that we got to take out? I know a bunch of the stuff's just like these farmer guys here. I think there's a guy down in this building as well. Oop. That might not be ideal. I mean, technically this is only two, so we should still be okay. Maybe. Helps if I actually had... Stop running. Run back over here. Gonna heal up a little bit. Oh, uh, some more healing. I'm flint. Uh, I'm saving my earth shock for when this guy tries to run like that. Which ideally I should probably get a uh, frost shock on my bar. So you know what? We'll eat some watermelon, seeing as how we picked it up. And let me grab Frost Shock. Which isn't actually in, in hands for some reason. It's in Elemental. And I'm going to put that on my bar. We'll move Flame Shock for now. I just want to slow down the speed of these guys running away from me. But I also want to drop down here. Actually, we don't have to kill any of these guys. Farmers and peasants. We do need farmers. I resisted. All right, is he in here? No, I do believe he's, oh, there it is. Like I knew they were in this field. Just wasn't sure where. Because I do remember uh, doing this quest. A bunch. On all the guys I was leveling up. Yeah, we're going to freeze you again. That way you can't run away so quickly. Alright. Go ahead and we'll Earth Shock. That way they can actually run to us quickly. And then we'll use the other uh, Frost Shock. Come on. And I'm just trying to open up a lane so that way when that farmer passed back, I should be able to grab him. Right there. What do you know? All right. We'll pull them. I'll even throw down my, uh, dang totem. We'll try to do as much damage as we can. And there we go. Now we just like the... Oh no wait. Farmer Ray. I think that's the guy up here in the other building. I mean we'll get them all eventually. 
just a matter of time. Oh, I'll go ahead and use that, uh, roll. And we need farmers and farm hands. You know what? I'm going to throw down a totem over here. Yeah, slow down. Go ahead, get our mana back. And we'll try to finish all these, but we'll see where we get to. Ooh. All right, so we got farmers, farm hands. Trying to do it so I don't end up pulling like ten guys, because that's not what I want to do. <laughs> oh, you disarmed me? That was rather rude. All right, we're definitely frost shocking. Peasant. I'm gonna go ahead and heal up because I was getting kind of low on health there. Frost shocks. Alright, that's somebody else causing all that. The higher level 28 mage. And we also got some other people over here as well. So while they're doing all that, I may head over here. Because we may as well try to go get the farmer guy over here. Oh yeah, Stanley. Forgot about Stanley. Was the guy up here? That yeah, farmer raise up here. But they must have just now killed him. So What do we do while we're waiting for Farmer Ray to respawn? Guess I'll go over here and get this farmer. And I still need two farm hands. So we'll just pull this guy back over here. They came out and then we just need one more. And then we just have to worry about the rest of the like named people. Ooh, silk cloth. So we need one farmhand, Farmer Ray. And then these two, I may have to come back later to get. Because like I said, they're kind of in some tricky spots. One being like totally inside that main building. Oh, there's another farmhand. That 
cow just scared the crap out of me. Alright, oh, uh, there's a footman there. Definitely not what I want. Did that aggro me? No, I don't think so. Somebody else. Those bread farmer. I just want farmer Ray. Now, if I'm not mistaken, he spawns like right in here. Which is the reason I'm up here. Come on. Everything else around here is respawning, so. Alright, there's a farmer downstairs. Not too worried about. I just want Farmer Ray. And then I'll probably go get some more Mountain Lion Blood. Because we may wait to do this one. I guess we'll have to check to see how it looks. Because yeah, that one's like right in the middle of everything. And that one's down in the mine. Yeah, I remember that now. That mine one kind of sucks. I mean, there's a Hillsbred farmer. We can take this guy out. Oh, there's farmer right now. Of course. Like, once I go to start attacking something, we'll use our little Blood Fury. Oh, please don't. Please don't. All right, we need to heal a little bit. All right. Uh, might as well go ahead and use that. Come on. Hey. All right, so the farmer's down now. And now the, I only like one more thing over here, which is the council member, which might actually be a pain depending on, ah, crap. Uh, no, thank you. Please let me run away. I don't want none. Please reset. All right. Wow. They beat the crap out of me. All right, let's uh, drink up some milk. And we'll get some... Uh, Mountain lines really quickly, and then I may go check out that quest real quick before we head over here. Because I don't actually remember what this quest is. Mountain lion blood. Vicious bears. Common that's level 35.
All right. Uh. Trying to think. Trying to think if there's quests to go along with this, because I think there is, but for some reason we don't have it yet. Ooh, we're low on health. Did not even know that. But I heard it. Alright. Why is this guy, like, destroying us? Alright, let's drink some milk. While I sit here and think. Yeah, because this guy's, like, dead in the middle of that building. This one's down in the mine. And these guys are tons of fun. The rescue. All right, let's go ahead and we'll do ghostful form. We'll run to see if anybody's actually uh, taking out the guys over here by this building. I don't think that there is. I think they just quickly went, ran through a second ago. Oh, there's guys down here. But it doesn't look like anybody's really messing around up there. So I'm not going to do that quest yet. Because those are like level 26s and stuff. And I don't have... Like, the power to be doing that right now, this second. Because we're talking like multiple uh, level 26s and stuff. I will run over here and grab this quest. I should have grabbed it when I first ran over here. I just totally forgot to. Let's head up here. What now? Travel to Terran Mill and deliver, yeah. Oh, uh, what's that? Copper? Yeah, we don't need that. Alright, we'll go to Terran Mill real quick. Turn in these quests. Uh, see if we get any other ones. And... And we'll probably head over here to... Uh, That little place. Can't think of the name of it. I know they redid this area for a uh, dungeon and Wrath of the Lich King. Where you like time travel back in time. And you're helping Thrall with uh, clearing that place out. I don't even know if it was... Was it Thrall? You're helping somebody. But... That's been a while since I've actually did that quest though too. I did run it like... Or not quest, dungeon. But I did run it like a ton... Uh, back when I was doing that stuff in like Ratch of, uh, Wrath of the Lich King. But yeah, this is a fun little place to go around and quest and stuff. 
I mean, there's not like a whole bunch, but like I said, once you hit a certain point, it's like you have to do a couple of levels of quest here, go to another place, do a couple of levels, and then like you end up making a loop around coming back because, uh, ow. Yeah, attack my totem, please. Leave me alone. Oh, wow. All right, well, get slowed at least. Now I really miss my, uh, super fast ghost wolf form. There's a weaponsmith over here. I forgot about that, too. Well, we'll go turn these in real quick and see what's up with the other quests and stuff. Because if you notice, some of these are, like, white things. They're future quests that we can get, but we're just not high enough level yet. To get them. Ooh, not dangerous. Time to strike. Uh, battle. Peasants, yes. Uh, syndicate personnel. No, we haven't done that one yet. Alright, uh, so we got this quest now as well. Human skulls. We can do that. And what's this one? Oh... Uh, Oh, here's some leather boots. Find the elixir of suffering. Blossoms. Is that? Okay, blossoms. No, the human skulls. Where's the blossoms then? Over here. Oh yeah, I think I remember that now. Like a field. Oh, there's the quest. Ooh, little frogs to give. Oh, he died. What do we do now? Loot and use the banished gold key from Jailer. Oh, that's all the way over there, though. Uh, Elixir Pain. Oh, yeah, we gotta use that, like, on Stanley, right? Yeah, we gotta go use the Elixir Pain on Stanley. And we got our faction up with, uh, these guys enough so that, that they're... Now they're green instead of yellows. Which is always nice. And now that I think about it, I believe this up here is... Is it? I can't remember. It's one of the PvP things, I believe. Rathy Basin, yeah. And then over here in the Barrens... Or Crossroads... Like right there, I believe that's Warsong Gulch. And I'm going to guess, I think I saw this as a vanilla server, you actually got to go there to queue those. Maybe. I'm not sure how that works on this server yet. Uh, is there any quests down here? I can't remember if there's anything in this building. Oh, all right. Well, at least we got that part done. I can sell off some of my stuff, repair real quick. Um, we'll lose a lot of stamina. 
Eh, we'll just use what we're using right now. I'm just gonna sell a bunch of this stuff. Cooking. I might actually want to save that. But I think I'll call that here for this video. And we'll start working on the rest of this stuff. But uh hopefully hopefully you guys have enjoyed. And I hope to see you in the next part. Where we'll more than likely be filling some more stuff around here. So hopefully you enjoyed and hope to see you in the next one.